Right, we better make a move. Travis is me really bad this early. Oh, I could do some more kit. I should have cancelled the appointment and got a later one. I could redo that this this morning. I don't think so. Now, up and at them, please. Come on. Run about David. I heard all that business with Gita last night. So you saw his face then? Guilty. He looked embarrassed to me. I mean, not that he shouldn't have been, but... But what? But don't tell me you defended him, Lorraine. I thought you were smarter than that. I know, David. And doing what Gita did last night is not going to have any effect. That's what you're saying. Let me talk to him. Come on, say what? Uh, speaking as your ex-wife, I'd just like to find out where you've been your girlfriend. I'm sure he'd oblige. Have you got a better idea? I'm only trying to help. I've got to pop out for ten minutes to see Joe. OK. Everything all right? Well, I need to find David. Joe's playing up again. Well, it's not really surprising, is it? I mean, living with David Wicks can't be easy for any kid. What do you mean? Well, he's not much of a dad from what I've seen, besides... And besides what? Well, it's just say he's living on borrowed time. What are you talking about? He's Joe's dad. He ain't fit to be anybody's dad. Well, where is he? I don't know. He didn't tell me where he's going. If that's your attitude, no wonder he doesn't want to come home. Lorraine, you want something because I've had a bad day and I don't need this. And what about what Joe needs, eh? I'll give him what he needs. And what about this mess with Cindy? I mean, that can't be helping Joe settle down, can it? It's no good for me, neither. Look, don't worry about Joe. He'll be OK. Things will get better, you'll see. It couldn't get much worse. If Grant has anything to do with it, they could. Well, what's going on with Grant? Well, he's not happy with what you've done to his family. <laughs> his family? That's a laugh. Since when did he care about Ian? What do you mean what I've done? He's done far worse in his time and to his own family. Like what? It can't be worse than your track record. Where do you want me to start? Uh, putting his brother in a coma? Beating his wife up? Tell me when you've heard enough, won't you? Grant wouldn't do anything like that. Wouldn't he? You ask anyone around here, Lorraine. The bloke is a nutter. Everything OK? Yes, thanks. Right. What's up? Oh, I just had a bit of a row with David. Oh, yeah? It's hard with Joe playing up sometimes. Before you know it, tempers are flying. Are they? You're not trying to tell me that David Wicks got rough with you, are you? David? No, he's got his faults, but he'd never do that. Yeah, well, you'd be surprised, Lorraine, what some men are capable of. David Wicks is no exception. Yes, he is. Yeah, but you don't have to thump someone to hurt them, do you? No, but it must be hard to forgive somebody who did, well, you know, hit you or whatever. Don't you think? I suppose so. I know I could never forgive a man who did that to me. What's this all about? Oh, nothing. It's none of my business. What's none of your business? I'm sorry. I shouldn't have said anything. No, hang on. I thought we were talking about David Wicks. How comes we're suddenly talking about me? Well? It's just all your history with people. What are you talking about? Well, come on, say something. You started this. What history? What people? Your brother. And Sharon. I don't believe I'm hearing this. Where are you going? To live up to my reputation. <laughs> 